Hello, Salem Elementary. It is I, the Habits of Mind Master, coming to you again with a new habit of mind for the month of January. We will be learning about metacognition. The word metacognition sounds very big and hard to understand, but it's not. It simply means to think about your thinking. And we do this on an everyday basis. For example, when you are reading and you're monitoring your success or making sure your mind is not wandering, that is metacognition. If you are thinking about the reading that you are doing. Also, metacognition is when you can explain your thinking or why you are choosing a particular way to attack a problem. Now, you are not using metacognition if you say, I don't know, I just did it. That is unacceptable of students at Salem Elementary and future Habits of Mind Masters. You must be deliberate or purposeful in everything you do and know why you did the steps. Talk yourself through it and say, I am doing this because of this. You need to be reflective or you need to think deeply about why you do certain things when you show metacognition. We cannot make sure that we let our minds wander, but make sure that all of our thinking is purposeful and it is meaningful. The habit of mind metacognition can be tough to do for some, but if you put your mind to it and you think about your thinking, you will have no troubles. This is closely related with applying past knowledge because when you think about your previous knowledge and how it applies to a new situation, you are then showing metacognition, which will help you solve a great deal of problems and will make sure that you are extremely successful. Remember to do your Habits of Mind worksheets. They're two-sided and blue this month. So that way you can become a habit of my master like me. I will see you all soon. Please be sure to always use your habits of mind. Do your worksheets so you too will become a master. Goodbye, everybody.